Sejuani's big counters in the jungle are champions that can invade and bully her in the early game, like Lee Sin, with his insane level 1 and level 2 damage and ability to chase her down if she queues a wall. Xin Zhao for the same reason as Lee, and Vi because her Q can prevent her from running away, and she can also ignore her armor. Twitch and Shaco have really interesting level 1 or 2 invades, and Elise level 3 has few champions that can out-damage her in 1v1 in the jungle. Sejuani's passive grants her a slow immunity as well as armor and MR boost when she hasn't taken damage for a while, and also makes her deal extra damage to enemies she stuns herself. Her Q is a dash that knocks champions up, whereas her W will make her swing her flail, which will hit enemies twice with a short delay in between, which will grant 2 stacks to her E. Her E is called Permafrost, and it will allow Sejuani to stack passively on enemies she or melee allies hit. After 4 stacks, enemies can get stunned by her if she activates it. Her ultimate will stun the first enemy it hits, and will create a storm around the impact zone that slows enemies standing on it. This might be the ultimate CC champion. Almost all of her abilities can stun or knock you up. The fact that her passive deals extra damage to enemies she stuns makes for some very high damage you might not be accounting for. Sejuani thrives in the jungle, meaning she'll take smite flash combo. So will you if you're a jungler. Take the blue smite versus her if you want to invade and get a chance of chasing her down. As for her power spikes, as I said earlier, she has a pretty weak early game in the jungle, but gets a great burst in the mid game. Late game she might be hard deleted by some AD carries, but her utility from her stuns is still immeasurable. Her level 6 is arguably her best power spike, allowing her to keep enemies from moving for the longest time, and items like Cinder Hulk grant her tons of damage due to her glue-like capabilities. Gargoyle's Stone Plate will make her unkillable and allow her to easily escape, so have an open eye for that. Thank you for tuning in and remember, pick a strong early game champion and invade her for some easy level 1 or level 2 kill, abuse her weak early game and try to counter her ganks, and get some CC reduction items like Mercury's Threads or Mercurial Scimitar. Ultimately, have fun doing it.